hit him. What the fuck, dude? All right. So, <laughs> a couple days ago, I hit a street point with, uh, like, those little metal nails that pop out. I grabbed my exhaust, totaled out the AFE cat back, and it destroyed my bumper. <laughs> so... We are, I got a stock exhaust from the junkyard and we're on the way to go get my, the flanges uh, rotated because it came off of a 325 and for some reason BMW made the 330s have the flanges rotated at a different angle than all the rest of them. So. Yep. Ugh. You gotta drive with this in my car. <coughs> and it is ridiculously loud. Making progress. All right, ladies and gents. So this bad motherfucker right here, shut yourself out, man. Spool 36, folks, spool 36. Turbo M52 E36. Anyway, this guy, he's a bad motherfucker, all right? Cause this shit wasn't gonna work cause this exhaust came off at 325. Massive shout out, huge love to, to spool 36 right here. Bro's a fucking demon. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> cool. That was a big one. <laughs> that was a big one. <laughs> <laughs> I call this one a no looker. He's not looking, ladies and gentlemen. Look at that. He's not looking. He's welding and he's not looking. Oh my God, folks. Look at that. Look at that tack, folks. Without looking. Come on. Woo. Come on. Quit playing with me. Quit fucking playing with me. Uh-oh. <laughs> All right. This should be good, though. Drop that bitch. Drop that bitch. Let's drop that bitch. All right, folks. We're all welded up. It's ready to go back in for the final time. Very nice. Very nice. Ready for this? Let's hear it. Oh, oh it's super quiet. <laughs> boys we're out here doing some more fixing taking off the rest of what's left of the diffuser about to take the bumper off and then stitch this up and then uh just put it back on that way that's because the mount is still there none of the mounts broke they just came off so i'll just go ahead and reattach them and be all good all right boys got the good old bumper off uh did a lot more damage than I thought. It destroyed my bash bar, which I mean, I guess is better than it destroying the frame rail. Frame rail is still super straight. Good to install another bumper. The only thing is that right here was literally bent a 90 degree angle up. So it was kind of a bitch to get out and put a hole in my trunk, but fuck that, I don't care. Just hammered that shit back in place, bolted this back up. Uh, I'm gonna go get a new bash bar from the junkyard, but I should still be able to rig this up to get it back on to where it doesn't look like uh, this. <laughs> all right, boys, bumper's all stitched up. What the fuck is going on with that? Bumper's all stitched up. I'm about to slap her back on. Fuck yeah. Oh yeah. 
We got some new scratches on her, but it's like it didn't even happen, dude. Fuck yeah, dude. That's badass. Drift stitch looking nice. I'm hyped, dude. Hell yeah. All right. Now it's the final piece of the puzzle. The trim. Well, this one doesn't go in that all that good because it got ran over, but it works. Ow. Like it never fucking happened, baby.